down here this morning and stress that this this is long overdue the special session as far as we're concerned and the redistricting process the uh, food tax reduction these things just are a start to what we really need to be doing in West Virginia it's all about creating jobs and having certainty and doing things to keep our kids and our grandchildren here and a half percent reduction in the food tax that you were for and now against and now for lowering just isn't leadership to me we need to address things in West Virginia that really mean something redistricting is something that is huge huge out here in the hinterlands as uh, people call it just go to Shrewsbury and you'll find out that we need single member districts badly we need representation that's fair and honest to everyone and one person one vote is the thing we should be living by and if that doesn't come out of the session I've said I would be doing and Governor Tomlin and acting Governor Tomlin temporary Tomlin has said he would he's against anything that isn't single member districts we need to veto anything that isn't single member districts we have huge uh, things we should be looking at in addition to single member districts here we need comprehensive civil justice reform. We in, need an intermediate court. We need to address our Marcellus Shale. It's a huge opportunity for our state. We need to keep our kids and our grandchildren here by creating jobs and making easy to be in business in West Virginia. And there's nothing in this uh, special session that's addressing our business climate at all and creating jobs. It's all about politics as usual to me. It's not about being practical and keeping our kids here and making it easier to be in business and growing our economy. It's uh, the same old, same old to me. It's not being it's about career politicians not being practical. But uh, we're glad to be here, and thank you for taking the time to see us, and we look forward to moving this state forward. One thing I will tell you, when I'm elected governor, we'll have a special session. We'll address these issues uh, and create an immunity court and have comprehensive Marcel Shale legislation and move our state forward. We look forward to it.